Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to The Long Dark. So, 82% cured and 91% cured um, on the two bear hides. The uh, wolf pelts I have are cured, the guts are all fully cured as well. Um, I did cook some more bear meat um, and I cooked a bunch of herbal tea. I don't know if you guys can actually see. <laughs> I don't know if you can actually see. Um, I cooked a bunch of herbal tea, um, dropped off some more stuff. I did go and get some more reclaimed wood here. Um, the water, I have a fair amount of water, but obviously we can have more. But for this video, we are just pretty much, oh, I never actually looked around the back of um, Jackrabbit Island. Um, but yeah, for this video, I maybe want to go to the houses on the hill over here and search the cabins that are like literally just outside of um, the gas station. Maybe hoping at some point maybe we see a moose here. I don't really know. Like it won't do us really any good um, because uh, we've already. I think as well. I think. I to harvest this for it to actually be any good honestly I think I have to harvest it or oh, we're gonna get hypothermia I get yeah I think I have to harvest it I think quartering it is only good for you to be able to like take it to an area because that's like nine percent this here is 63 percent and then the ones that I, I did like straight away almost there are 90 percent so i think it's better um but anyway sorry i'm just gonna mold them it's moldy me me it's all moldy why is it moldy freezing okay i'm gonna take some with me I'm gonna go to this house over here. I know that we're like freezing. So I just wanna like get into somewhere warm. I hope I don't have permanent hypothermia. Hypothermia risk, it's fine. It should go, yeah, it should go away. As we are warming up. Um, I didn't bring, I didn't bring um, a lantern, sorry. So this. Okay, I didn't get food poisoning from it, so that's like, that's a plus, I guess. What's this on the floor? Nothing. At least we're warming up now. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like um, her quartering it is only good for you to be able to take it to the location that you want it at. And then you're better off just like, har yes, coffee. Shh, good. Because I, ah, more coffee. Handy. I wasted um, a few cups. They were burnt. I know I took them off the heat. Oh yes, another cooking pot. Oh, another cooking pot. Great. This place is good. This place is good. Um, but yeah, I burned some coffee backs, and I know I took them off of the thing. So I'm wondering if they just like stayed too hot um, for too long. I don't know. And they like burnt. No idea. Um, but yeah. So the I think if I quarter anything from now on. I will like take it to where I want to take it and then I will just harvest it straight away because I don't think that leaving it in the bags is a good idea. Maybe that's why it's gone moldy. I don't want to do that. Should I destroy this house and take all the wood back with us? Would that be like a good shout? Maybe that's something that we could do like later down the line. I don't know. Were there stairs? No, there weren't stairs here. I don't need a light. So yeah, I just want to search these cabins. Ooh, more red plugging. Wonder if I can drop any of this gear. We don't need to drop anything. I will take like the trousers and the shoes and stuff because they'll be good for leather, and I can just drop them back off straight um, inside the gas station. Which is good. Gotta have the clothes. I don't know where to um, 
venture off from here. So I know we have the lookout tower, which I would like to go to. I think the way that I normally get to that is I normally like go up this way. So I normally like follow the like path of road that, that goes around here and goes up. Um, so I think I might do that. Uh, oh, socks. I think I can use this. To get to that tower. Oh, a flare. Yes, my favorite. Um, but yeah, and then we will have like the fishing cabins so, or some more fishing cabins. And then we also have the fishing camp over here, which I did search a little bit of um, when we come into this area. But I didn't. I don't think I took anything with me. At least I don't think I did. Um, right. No bear. Do you think a match would scare me? I'm so sad about this dog bed. It's like doggy outhouse place. Right, let me drop off these clothes. Just because um, we don't need to drag them everywhere with this. Week. Yeah, I got rid of the pallets that are outside here. Honestly, I thought that they would actually give us more reclaimed wood than they actually did. But what can you do? What can you do? Let me drop them off in here should be able to yeah okay so I'm wearing those which is good I think um, we have another pair of pants I will be leaving the wolf skin I see it's 85% now so it's done really really well did I get rid of these socks no I'm wearing socks um okay yeah I, I think that we're doing pretty well um, I will leave the cooking pot here. Oh, as well, uh, yeah, I don't need to take all this water with me. <laughs> I don't need to take all this water with me. We'll leave all three here. Um, the bedroll stump remover. I didn't even know I had stump remover on me. Revolve around. Oh, the charcoal is, like, a big thing for me. Because where I want to map everything, maybe I'm taking a little bit too much with me everywhere. But I'm also like, you know, it's justified. <laughs> it's justified. Have we searched this? Nice. Nice jacket. Or jumper. Sweater. Whatever you want to call it. That literally did naffle. So, oh, I could have left some flesh. I got a bit a freaking sprain risk from picking up a flare that is literally <gasps> oh yes okay I'm here. just gonna drop off this thing in here so we can't get to the bleak inlet from this area can we because otherwise I'm gonna have to drag like all of this lead and stuff like back with me because I also have all of the stuff around here like these which um I think it's used to make the gunpowder I think or the bullets no lead is for the bullets I think the sulfur stuff can be used for the gunpowder I think it is um but yeah I don't know if we can get from coastal highway to the bleak inlet? I might actually have to look that up, see if we can. Um, now do I go to this house first and the back? Yeah, we'll do this one first. I hope I can get in. Oh goodness. I can just hear them. Oh, no battery, that would have been too good to make it true. <laughs> oh, I don't actually know if I've searched the like cars that are literally right in I'm gonna front. Have to leave something behind. Oh, there's a book in here. Yeah, I don't know if I've searched the cars that are right in front of the gas station. I also wish that you could switch from front seat to back seat in a car because like you're able to <laughs> in real life. So I just felt like you should be able to in the game. I'm just gonna survey here. Okay, that didn't actually do what I thought it was going to do. Anyway, anyway, anyway. 
More co- Oh, I could have dropped off the coffee. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Granola bar. Oh, condensed milk. Is it good? Is, is it, it good? Is it good? Zero percent. That's another one we will eat before we go to sleep. I haven't actually come across a house with a first aid kit in it for, for like a little bit. So I'm hoping that maybe this one has a first aid kit in it with some more antibiotics. Because if I keep eating the bad food, I know I'm going to keep needing antibiotics. So... I need to make sure I actually have some spare matches. Nothing else. Oh, I see some shoes. We'll take them so that we can tear them down or just like leave them there. Try and put everything in one place. Oh, another jumper. That one looks nice. If that's lighter than the one that I have on at the moment. Um, okay, heavy, worn by people on cold boots. Or maybe I should do this one instead. It's 50. Or, oh, it is actually lighter. Ooh, okay. I'm tempted, I'm tempted. So maybe we should do it as, that's the outer layer. No, that's the outer layer. This is the inner layer. So let's do this one. Yeah, we'll do that. I will leave this one because I quite like this one, but I think this one here is um good. I will repair it. I will repair it. Wonder if this Ketchup is Ketchup chips by the bed. Midnight snack. <laughs> What's your preferred midnight snack? Ketchup chips, apparently. I don't think I've ever had like a midnight snack. But I think for me it's like like late night snack kind of thing so it's like jelly this gear starting to slow me down like squishies um i can't remember what they're called like the little drumstick squishy thingies um they are so freaking good i think you have apple and cherry ones and then you have like the standard ones um i think they're strawberry and milk i think i don't know but they're so so good I'm gonna actually, I might, I'm gonna go back to the gas station. Cause that house looks promising. I hope. I don't see any bears or wolves. Did I do, I did the two houses over there in the last episode, didn't I? It's so misty. What is weighing me down so much? Is it the clothes? I will drop off the coffee as well. And I will get some stuff to drink. I did spend a little bit of time here. But not an awful lot. The uh, um, I'm going to leave this here even though it's good. Maybe I should swap oh, this, this one slowing me down. with that one. Um, these boots. I mean, what boots am I wearing? On what boots? That can go in there. That can go in there. Okay, great. And then let's wear this. Um, but yeah, I spend a little bit of time in here. I think that's why the bear hides are almost done. I think I can read this. Or maybe I should put away some of the food that I've been finding. Oh, the gran I wonder, do the granola bars and stuff make you sick? I know that the... um. The sodas don't, but do the granola bars? I imagine they would, because it's like a food food. What a percentage are you on now? 83 and 92. We're getting there. We should, I'm hoping to be able to start, at least start the bear, um, the bear skin jacket in this video. Because I forgot it actually takes like X amount of hours. I honestly... <laughs> I honestly thought that like you could just like do it in like a day but I forget that they actually take a wee little bit of time okay right let's go to this house over here should I mark them no there's no point so 
have a look at this. Mailbox, nothing. Oh, did I search the trunk of the other car? I might have to drop some gear. Um, there's just some gloves in the back. We'll leave them. Oh, you know. Oh, okay. I thought it wasn't gonna let us pick up the sewing kit. Um. Okay. 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 This one should have an upstairs. Yay! It has an upstairs. Urban Parker. I think I might actually use a match. What is the time? Midday. No flares. Oh, there is. There's always a flare. There is always a flare under the benches. Not that I'm complaining, because I, I like the flares. Um, okay. Soda. Mm, coffee? No. Another cooking pot. Nice. And more coffee. Great. I'm so happy. I'm so happy with the coffee. It's a shame when you cook the coffee in the saucepans, like the cooking pots, that you can't- oh good antibiotics- um, that you can't cook more than one cup at a time, considering it does like two litres worth. You should be able to do like a good- maybe like three or two cups of coffee even out of one pot. I guess it depends how strong you have it. Um, nothing else, okay. Upstairs be good to me. Imagine if there was a wolf inside what, like, one of the houses. Oh cool, some more of this stuff. And another spray can. Uh, ketchup chips. nice i know i'm using a lot of matches but i have like 300 of them so i feel like it's i feel like it's okay neglecting the fact that obviously when i stop being able to find matches i like won't be able to make a fire anymore maybe i shouldn't be using them if you use like one match a day that's 350 days i could survive for providing that the fire lights every single time I, so I think I picked up a fire striker somewhere. I don't know where. I don't know if I've still got it on me or if I dropped it off somewhere. Knowing me, I probably dropped it off somewhere, but I'm pretty sure that we picked one up at some point. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. It's okay. It's okay. Should we sleep? There's no point in sleeping, right? Okay, I think I'm gonna get outside and I'm gonna survey. Just, um, because I kind of have no explanation for it. I just want to get outside and survey a little bit. I'm hoping that maybe it- oh, I'm hoping that maybe it will, like, survey a little bit further that way. Maybe? No, not as much as what I thought it would. Okay, um, in that case, let's head back to the gas station. I might read that book and repair the gear. Seeing as the bear hide, the, yeah, the bear hide, it was like 92%. I don't know if that's like another like half a day or something to make it the full um, percentage, but I can't imagine it's an awful lot, so I don't want to. I don't want to venture off like too far, and then have to like come back and make it. I think I want to make it. What is this? What's oh, a stone? I think I want to make it like as soon as, so that we can leave the wolf one here. Oh, maybe I can hack that up. Okay, yeah. So let's um. 
Let's take out all of these damaged goods and I will take out some shoes as well to harvest them so that we can get some leather and stuff. And yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Okay, right, I do believe I have a cabin fever risk. So I'm just going to spend... Oh, I need the hacksaw for that crap. I'm just going to spend a little bit of time out here um, harvesting some clothes and stuff like that. I'll check the water in a minute because that also is going. I hate cabin fever. It's like the worst. It's like the worst thing in this Sunset. game. It's going to get a lot colder Just soon. because I like to, like, I like to spend a lot of time indoors because, like, you know, it's safe in there, and if you have the means to do so, like the food or and the water and everything like that, especially a place like this that has like a little fire in it, I think a place for me personally that is like the best is a place of like a six burner stove. That's like the best. So I am outside. Cabin fever is slowly going down, but it's still there, so I guess we will carry on repairing our stuff. I swear it just hurt. It sounded like, honestly, it sounded like a freaking goat. <laughs> it sounded like a goat. I think I'm gonna do this last pair of shoes. I'm gonna need to rest soon. And then we'll go inside, and I think I will just sleep for the rest of the night. Um. Just because we can, and I don't think any of this is inedible, which is good. Okay, right. We've slept. I don't have cabin fever risk anymore. 91% and 99%. Okay, awesome. That feels is like a great. lot of gear. I think what I will do is I will repair the. Uh, wolf skin one just because we can just because the wolf skin is here but i am still gonna just like sit outside <laughs> for a minute or two or for maybe like the day i don't know i think we'll just um i think we'll just sit out here just so i don't get cabin fever because that's gonna be really bad but we will repair this it's gonna take an hour and 42 minutes apparently i need to find food Okay, the weather is getting pretty bad. I'm wondering if being outside in bad weather and then going inside... Uh, going inside... You, like... It reduces cabin fever risk because you've spent a lot of time, like, outside in really bad weather. I could be completely wrong. I'm probably am. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, I'll take this in as well and we will harvest the battery. Pretty sure there's a- yeah, there's a hacksaw through there. We can make it, we can make it. Okay, it goes from being like 15 to 1.5, which is not too bad. So I think I'm just gonna pop it through here with the rest of this stuff. With the stump remover and all of that as well. Okay, great. We have a lot of this. It definitely is something that I am going to want to take, like, with us. Or maybe if I just, like, if I leave it here. Oh, I wish you could stack this better. I wish you could, like, stack it, stack it. I think there's a mod where you can put things, like, closer together. I never tried mods, um for the long dark. We'll just put him here. Okay, there's a bunch of, <laughs> there's a bunch of lead there. There's a bunch of lead there. Okay, let's uh, drop this. I should 92 and 100. Great, great, great. So that's cured. That's 92. Again, I just think I'm just gonna wait around here a little- Oh, we could actually probably- let me just see- well, let me see what I have on me. Anything that is not 
necessary. I can go in here and then we will go or we'll have a look at the house on the hill as we can. Uh, there are so wow I didn't actually realize how many stone kits we have on me and I also have like three of them on the table which are brand new so there's like three brand new ones there and then I also have like three on me <laughs> I have like three on me that are also brand new crazy I still got that book to read as well, but yeah. I don't think I will be able to survey because it's really bad. Unless I just read the book. I think I'll read the book for a little while out here. Oh, I've already done it. Why can't I research? Uh, research already completed. Oh, okay. That sucks. That sucks, that sucks. Okay, let's just uh, drop the book then. And I will continue to make some water and do everything that way. Okay, so I see a bear. I don't know if you guys will be able to see him, but he's just over there. You see him? Um, and I, so I don't know when it was that we killed the bear. I should have put a note in the journal, but we have almost survived for 100 days, which I'm so, so happy about. So the bear's over there. The bear skin bed, I repaired some of my clothes, but because I was spending time outdoors just like repairing them and stuff, they've like lost durability again. This one I'm not too bothered about repairing too much, just because this is what I will replace the crampon, crampons. Um, they're frozen. Frostbite wrist. Okay, so do I drop them if they're frozen? Would that help me? Maybe that would help me if they're frozen to like drop them. I'll see if I can start a fire and um, heat them up because I would really, I'm just gonna, I know I don't have to use tinder but I'm gonna use it. Um, but yeah, so I'm hoping that they unfreeze themselves. Come on. I would have thought Come using on. Tinder you have a better chance of making a fire, but I'm hoping that the bear hide is almost done. I really kind of want to kill the other bear, but I think I have enough food and that here at the moment. And I haven't ventured off really anywhere else. I did say that we would that's done. try and do the fishing camp, but that hasn't worked. So that's frozen. 4%. Okay, I think that's going down. Is my frostbite risk going gonna go down? Cover up uh, the afflicted area or find some place warm before frostbite develops. I mean, it was the gloves that were frostbitey. I'll just pop some water in here. Yeah, it's the gloves that were all frostbitey. I cannot have another frostbite risk. I mean, they're wet. They're not frozen. The only thing that was frozen was the gloves. Would they thaw out more if I wore them? Is that going to go up? <laughs> I don't want to get another frostbite. 86. I don't know if it if it's better for me to wear them to let them dry off. Or whether I should stick them like near a fire. Can I stick them on top of the fire? Probably not. Huh? Anyway, um let me I tell you what I will do. I am going to warm that up and we're gonna drink a cup of coffee. 
to give us like a, a warmth bonus thing uh so warming up so i think it's going down so we won't have a frostbite risk i've already got frostbite on that pair of that like pair of hands my goodness cool 99 percent awesome we're so close we're so close i just want to be able to make it um I'll tell you what let's eat i don't want to eat the soup Let's eat some bad chips and stuff. And then I think I might just pass time for like an hour and hope that this is done. Hopefully we'll see. Okay, cool. Frostbite is healed. They're still frozen, but that's okay. Oh, I can't put them here. <laughs> I was really hoping I'd be able to put them there. Oh my goodness, it's still 99. 99? Why is it taking so long? I think they'll be okay. I don't know if they're the best gloves for us. Heavy duty, uh, out of there, and wool liners, warm and tough. Okay, yeah. Warm and tough, I guess that's what we do want. Alright, let's see where this bear is. Because we've been, I've been dawdling indoors for a really long time. And he was heading that way. So I don't know. I'm wondering if he's gonna like smell his like <laughs> smell his friend who has been cooked. Rancid oh my goodness, it's rancid. We can still cook rancid meat though. Okay, seeing as I don't see him and I can't Watch, he's gonna be around the corner, isn't he? Okay, oh, I thought that was him then. Yeah, seeing as we. Can't, oh, there's a deer up here. He's obviously not this way. Seeing as I can't see him and I'm still waiting for the bear skin bedroll to be. the Sorry, the bear skin to be cured. I'm gonna head up this way to the little house that is up here. And then we can survey a little bit more as well, which is always good. Oh, I think there's a climbing rope to get to the other, the place that I was on about. So let's just survey this. Okay, that's better. That's almost connected that now. Coolie, coolie, coolie owls. I'm wondering if I survey over this way, if it will connect. Oh, hello, simple toolkit. Okay, good. It's like literally just connected. Just connected, which is fine. Okay, we'll search this house, and I really do hope that the bear did bear skin is fully cured because that is what I'm pretty much just waiting for. I didn't want to move off to like the lookout tower while the bear skin was still curing. I kind of want to make it literally just as it's fully cured. Could end up being useful. Um, okay. Oh my goodness, peanut butter! 10%. I will take it. We'll take it. Peanut butter and bear meat. Hmm. That is a combination. Another cooking pot. 
damn do i really need another cooking pot though how much do they weigh they weigh one i'm wondering if it's better for me to take like a cooking pot or whether to take tins with me a tin is obviously lighter but cooking pots obviously cook a dance like more water and they may take longer but i don't know i feel like a cooking pot you know Okay, disinfectant, we don't really need, but I'll take it anyway. You can never be too sure, right? More ketchup chips. More snow boots. Accelerant. I think I'm just going to leave that jacket here. My goodness, she says that she takes, like, the hat and everything else. <laughs> oh my goodness. The gas station is definitely gonna be stocked gonna be stocked oh nice the knife not that i need another knife at all but you know i guess it's always good to have one at a place where you've been if i have like um a couple of different bases you can just like travel between them all the time and like leave stuff there so each base has this like pack is a too knife heavy to carry. and crowbar and stuff like that but then obviously you would have searched everywhere around that area so you're not actually really gonna need it so much water <laughs> so much water okay let's extinguish this because we don't need it i accidentally went to sleep with the lantern on like I was holding the lantern and I swore before that if you had the lantern on like and you clicked the bed and you chose to go to sleep yada yada that the character would like turn off the lantern I swear that that is how it worked but apparently that's not how it works anymore unless I was just like imagining it the whole time so I slept like a good 12 hours <laughs> I slept like a good 12 hours with the lantern on, which was not not great because I just wasted the fuel, but it's what it is. I haven't seen little Barry, so I'm hoping he's not coming this way. Otherwise, we're gonna be chow. Only a little puppy chow bear chow unless I could get into this house but I can't run so that's a problem <laughs> um I picked up another cooking pot I don't know what else I picked up in that house there wasn't any coffee or anything like that oh there was the peanut butter which was definitely good um I'm hoping fingers crossed that the bear hide is actually done now because I really just want to make it I feel like this this episode is maybe a little bit lackluster with what I wanted to do, but we have searched the houses just like just outside here. So, a bit of a win, bit of a lose, bit of a win. <laughs> Let me just drop off the... Oh, those are actually ruined. Oh, we can only harvest them? I would have thought that we could actually... Um, repair them if they were ruined ruined well let's not let our clothes get too far gone <laughs> let's not let our clothes get too far gone Another pri <laughs> we have so many pry bars who would have thought so many pry bars in one freaking area yay it's cured great finally i forgot how many guts we need um but we are going to go for the coat, um, like you guys suggested. Okay, so I need a four. Um, that one, 60 hours with the improvised one. Oh, hot damn, 45 hours with it. So the hunting knife is the better one. We'll go for that and we will try and do, let's do four hours to begin with. I didn't realize it would take that long. Um, but you know we we want it gotta have a snack in between <laughs> gotta have a snack 
I don't know if I got any food on me. I do. Maybe I should eat the peanut butter. Okay, we're getting cabin fever. Which is not great, but I have a solution. And that solution is to literally just sleep outside. Um, literally just like sleep out here. Uh, I'll do only a couple of hours at a time because I am terrified of getting eaten in my sleep. I think there's an aurora. Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, I love it here. Look at that shit! Sorry. That is like so freaking nice. Should I go and work on it for another couple of hours while there is like light in here? Oh that would be really, that would be handy as hell, yeah. Let's try and work on it for as many hours as we can, for as long as we can. And then I'll go sleep outside again. Okay, great. We got a good few hours with that, I just need some water. I think I might drink the herbal tea I found inside one of the homes. Goodness. Made it through another night. Wait, what? Are you joking? Are you joking? Are you joking? Wait, I have more frostbite now? Are you actually kidding me? Those gloves are freaking crap. I wasn't even cold out there. Like my cold meter didn't even go down. What the hell? Is that because I have frostbite on my hands so my hands are just more susceptible now to get frostbite? Because that's permanent. Oh shit, guys. Guys, I'm gonna have to be okay. This series is gonna end so fast. <laughs> I'm gonna be so sad. I hate myself. What the hell? I think I need I to use new gloves. Right now. Unless it's because I have frostbite. I'm just dooming myself. I like my temperature wasn't even going down though. Like I was warm out there. Like I wasn't getting cold or anything, but now all of a sudden I have frostbite. We're gonna need to eat soon. And I'm seriously wondering if it's because I, my hands are already frostbitten. So my hands are already frostbitey. So when my hands get cold, it's just gonna get frostbitey even more. Does that make sense? I don't know. I'm so sorry. I don't know what's wrong. I, that was like, I was so confident with being out there. Oh my goodness. Okay. I feel like for this series then, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be like, how many hours do we have? Let's see if we can do another 5.5. So yeah, for this series then, I'm not gonna be like, I guess no like too careful I'm just gonna try and like we'll just try and go with the flow of stuff we'll just try and go with the flow um, because that's another permanent frostbite now which is not good so I feel like I should only really sleep <laughs> indoors. Okay, right. 
we have made the bearskin coat. So, I could eat anything. What we need to do is I need to refill this. And we need no <laughs> I do not want to harvest that. <laughs> I could use a drink. Oh, I'm so pissed at myself. I'm so so pissed at myself. Okay, right. So that's good, that's it, that's good. Great. Let's put on these stupid ass gloves. I bet they're still freaking frozen. No, they're just wet. Stupid! Absolutely stupid. Okay, so now we are even more hurt than we have been before. Um, by a lot this time. By a lot. I genuinely... Frostbite times three caused by cold weather. Use the same frostbite, your general condition... Times three? So obviously it was a little bit, then it was a little bit more, and then still a bit more. Okay. That sucks. That sucks. So freaking bad. It's obviously definitely my mistake, but I'm wondering if because I already have frostbite on my hands that I'm just like... I guess more susceptible to getting frostbite again in the same area if that makes sense um <laughs> oh that really sucks if i get attacked by a wolf now or a bear like how much is my health gonna go down that's what i'm worried about like i'm not worried about hurting myself i'm worried about getting like attacked by a freaking bear but anyway, 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 day 101 celebration and we have three times frostbite. <laughs> oh dear. What was it I said in the last episode? We got to 120 something days. As long as I can outlive that, I'm good. We have so much stuff here. This place is a real freaking pigsty. Um... I think for this episode, I'm going to leave it here. This episode may be a little bit lackluster, but I definitely have obviously made a freaking huge ass mistake somewhere. I think the mistake that it happened was when I was sleeping outside, but literally, uh, let me repair this. I thought that it would be absolutely fine because my temperature wasn't going down like it wasn't going down a single bit so we thought you know it, it, like we're warm we're okay here but guys it turns out that we were not <laughs> we were not okay out there we were not um but yeah anyway uh for this episode thank you guys so so much i'm sorry i'm being so stupid with the whole frostbite stuff but at least we do have the bear skin jacket now which is really really great um so wolves should maybe be a little bit scared of us so if we ever do manage to make our way back into the bleak inlet not to say that they will but the timber wolves as well might be a tiny tiny little bit scared of us but obviously um they'll probably still hunt me freaking down but uh yeah uh, sprint 66% that's fine so I swapped out this for this why do I have this or that I don't need anything else on me um let's drop that and the hat because I don't need those either these gloves <laughs> I do I just I can't help but think like because I already have frostbite on my hands my frostbite bite my hands are the thing that are just gonna get more susceptible wait no is that frostbite no i have a spray <laughs> ah, where it's all going on it's all going on frostbite times three that's great thank you all so, so much for watching this video it's been a little bit lackluster but i'm hoping to be able to pick it up in the next one i swear i better not get any more frostbite <laughs> I really better not get any more frostbite. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. Hit the like button, leave comments. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Bye.